girl Ashley and Fabulous Veggies coming in with another test Tuesday. We have a special guest, Shanae. Hey, how's it be here? Yeah, she's mochas and mimosas for you. I have it up here. Follow her on the Instagram. Yes, <laughs> and you click on the video because we are going to be trying the Gordon Ramsay vegan bacon. How do you feel? Should be good. I'm excited. <laughs> vegan bacon I will tell you that um we have a little surprise we're gonna show the overhead of how to make it too because it's steps to it if you don't know it's steps to it so there's gonna be steps to it but you guys already know how we do test Tuesday we take a vegan plant-based product we taste test it we give a star rating and we wrap up the video at the end because why spend that money honey why exactly. spend that money honey if you don't have to you gonna do the work for you right <laughs> look, look at that that's gonna be the new slogan <laughs> Here's the vegan bacon. This is it. <laughs> we have to make it. Um, how do you feel? I was expecting something different. <laughs> I thought it was vegan bacon, like strips that was already formed and you mm -hmm. had to fry it. Cause I eat turkey bacon. So I think that's what I was envisioning. Uh -huh. But the vegan uh, version of that, yeah. So this looks like a piece of tofu. <laughs> yes, so it's it's tofu. I was surprised too by these steps. I mean look at all the ingredients we have. But so we're making the bacon. We're gonna make it. Yes, okay. we're gonna make I got it. You. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I love surprising people. Surprise! Surprise! <laughs> All right, so you're gonna get the ingredients breakdown and then we're just gonna do overhead really fast. All right, so I'm giving a close up of all the ingredients. First, we have the extra firm tofu. I got this from Kroger, uh, Simple Truth, I think it is their brand. Um, but what I did was I pressed it overnight and I, of course, in the Academy of YouTube, <laughs> found something that helped me to figure out how to press it because the recipe says to press it overnight. So what I did was I took um, two plates, like large plates, and then put on top of it like a pot and filled it with like rice and beans and just let it press overnight. And honestly, a lot of liquid got out of it. I mean, it's, it's kind of crumbled and cracked. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but we're crumbling it for the recipe. So here it is, that's the tofu. Here is the rice paper, got it from Kroger. My Earth Balance, because the recipe asked for the vegan butter, nutritional yeast. Yes, I went with my liquid smoke mesquite. That's my favorite. Then we have sriracha. I just chose this amber color maple syrup. You can do, I think, any one. It doesn't say in the recipe. And then I have my low sodium, uh, sodium, <laughs> soy sauce. Look at me trying, I'm sharing a lot. So it's a lot to get tongue tied. I got that <laughs> smoked paprika, the granulated garlic powder. It just said granulated garlic. I'm assuming it's the powder, but you know, whatever. And then fresh, we ain't doing fresh, okay? So I have just regular ground black pepper. <laughs> cayenne pepper and then three tablespoons okay of water. you guys so right now you're just gonna see a sped up version of what we're doing with making it and it's actually pretty interesting of a process what do you think Chanel it was pretty interesting a little messy <laughs> <laughs> because of the dipping and then the layering the tofu but I would say just make sure you have some napkins on him okay guys we are back and this is what it looks like let's see if we can get a close-up all done I mean, it's giving bacon, it's giving color, it's yes. giving crispy. Um, and the, the little wave. It's a, right, so a good tip, this uh, one YouTuber, shout out to him, I have his YouTube here. First off, he's way bigger than me, like way bigger, but we're gonna get there. He decided to like change it up a bit and he gave the tip to kind of lay the metal straws down to kind of give a wave effect. So shout out to him, because as you can see, the ones we didn't do that, it's like really flat, nothing in it. The other ones give more of an illusion of bacon, so I like that. Yeah, Now this one is giving me bacon. Yes, like <laughs> this one right here specifically is giving all the waves, yeah. okay? Um, now, I don't know, Gordon, we're, we're gonna try this. We're gonna grab mm -hmm. one. It's definitely different than pork bacon, <laughs> for sure, the look. And turkey bacon even so. But I would look at it and think meat. Yes. So it is giving me that. Yes. And the coloring I would say is good. You're, you're right, this yeah. does make me look like, bar it look like barbecue. Yeah, or maybe even like a jerky. <laughs> okay, it's kind of yeah, giving jerky. Yeah, you're giving jerky. 
Yes. Yes, because the flavors, like you really smell uh, the maple, the uh, mesquite, because yeah. that liquid smoke, it did Keep it. That up. Um, now it's just the taste. And but that's what's important. And that's, <laughs> what, and that's where the honesty is going to yes. come in. So be prepared. Here we go. All right. Out of my 
my food comfort zone because I'm not vegan by any means. <laughs> by no means. Not at all. But it was fun and I, I enjoyed it. I tried something different. I tried again. Yeah. Now, we, we have one last thing though. Sis has a cookbook. Okay. Here's the title. I do. Here's the title and the link is going to be below in the description. So make sure you support her, okay? Because, Thank you. you know, we have to support our good sis. Yes. Every time. You know, and you know, while you're there, you can also look at my cookbook. It's down there as well, you know. Exactly. Down the there as well. Is there too. Down there as well, boo. And of course, our socials are going to be here. So make sure to support, like, share, subscribe, and we will check you guys out next time. Bye bye. bye.